A fitness app co-founded by a Chicago resident has been featured by Apple as an app of the day in honor of Women's History Month. Julie Wallach, co-founder of Charge Running, joins us this morning to tell us more. Good morning, Julie. Hi, Brittany. Thanks for having me. Thanks for being on. So this is one way that Apple is honoring female creators. How did you find out that your app, Charge Running, was going to be featured as an app of the day? Apple did reach out to us and let us know we were extremely honored. Um, women are often underrepresented in tech and entrepreneurship in general. So the recognition was definitely special and, and we were honored. And especially during it's Women's special. History Month, I'm sure it means a lot. Now, I understand that your app is for fitness fans looking to join live classes from base runs to marathon training. Tell us about it. Sure. Our app is for iPhone, Android users. The goal is you log on to the app and immediately you'll be running with others from all around the world, wow. all while being coached in real time. So you'll have a coach, I'm actually one of the coaches myself, in your ear, welcome you to the run, telling you when to walk, telling you when to pick up the pace. It's a lot of fun. What inspired you and your co-founder to create this app? I have two other co-founders and we wanted to um, solve a problem that we all were facing and that was we actually didn't like running. Um, <laughs> we thought running was quite boring and we wanted a way to stay motivated and be engaged with each other in real time. So it's really nice to log on to the app, do a run and know that I'm never running alone. I always have somebody with me. I love that you shared that with us because, you know, many of us would think that the founders of a running app must love running, but so many of us, you know, we dislike that part of our workout. So what are, what is the key uh, to getting someone to enjoy, enjoy run, running? Well, what we found is that accountability is really helpful. It can okay. be nerve wracking sometimes to go to a group fitness class in person. Well, here we kind of take away all that anxiety. You pop in, you might not know anybody else you're running with, but they're all going through the same thing. You can interact in a chat room and say, oh, this is killing me, but I feel so good. And just knowing that you have somebody there with you as well as a coach to keep pushing you and motivating you, it really is special. What do you hope that the app will do for the fitness community here in Chicago, but, but also beyond? Um, really, we're just looking to kind of disrupt the running industry and say it's Ooh. okay to not love it. And here's a way to try and get better at it with people all around you that are trying to do the same thing. So we're really just trying to make a difference. For other women in tech, what is your biggest piece of advice for them? Keep going. Just keep going. Um, it's a roller coaster starting a business and you just got to keep plugging away and stay consistent. For more information, visit chargerunning.com. Julie, thanks so much for joining us this morning. Thank you. Coming up.